Hey guys, Jesse from Gridless Heating and Cooling. This video is going to be about Mitsubishi Heavy Industries multi-split offering. Specifically, we're going to be covering it under the Victorian Energy Upgrades Program if you're upgrading from duct gas, but it's gonna be useful regardless. This system is the Mitsubishi Heavy Industries 10 kilowatt system. That's what we're going to be dealing with, not the electric. There's gonna be another video about that soon. Uh, I also get a lot of questions, what's the difference between heavy industries and electric? They obviously both have Mitsubishi, they're different companies, but they come from the same uh, place originally, that's a while back. Uh, the systems are, are super good, So, but if you're talking about which one is better, Mitsubishi Heavy Industries probably has a slight edge in terms of customer reviews and customer service. Uh, but anyway, we're going to jump into the video, we're going to talk about the rebates that are available, we're going to talk about the ultimate cost to you, the consumer, the cost of the system and labor. We're going to talk about the benefits of this system, the advantages of this system over other systems, uh, and let's jump into it. So the first thing that I'll talk about is the fact that there are numerous multi-split offerings under the government scheme. You can get 10 kilowatt systems, 8 kilowatts, I think there's a 7, 6. I'll put up a little brochure here to show you what uh, sizes they can come in. Now, I would always recommend going for the largest possible system. The reason being is that is how you maximize the number of rebates that you are available for. So the VIGs, they're the rebates right now, and they're going for about $100 each. So if you want to get the most bang for your buck when you're participating in this rebate program, you want to get the largest system possible. And right now, that's the 10 kilowatt system. Interestingly, it is a 10 kilowatt system, but it goes all the way up to 16 kilowatts. You can put a couple more systems here than you would otherwise think, which makes it quite a viable option and you can connect up to five indoor heads to one outdoor multi-split system which is super super useful now let's jump into the cost so the cost of this system depends on the number of heads that you're getting so the heads come in the following sizes eight kilowatts of cooling 7.1 kilowatts 5 3.5 2.5 and 2 and so the prices of all these vary so in terms of the pricing for the system you're looking at about five to seven thousand dollars depending on the number of heads that you want for the systems and materials that are required and of course you have to pay for the installation as well and the current market rate is about one thousand to twelve hundred dollars per head to install in terms of the rebates that are available for the system you can get up to 44 vigs for the system they're currently trading at about a hundred dollars per vig so you can get up to four and a half thousand dollars in rebates which is pretty good. So that really takes down the price of the system. Now that is if you maximize the number of heads that you get. If you're not, you're going to get less rebates. So we have a link in another video showing you how to calculate these rebate amounts yourself. If you're looking for help in getting a system or getting quotes or anything like that, that's what we do here at gridless.com.au. So we can definitely help you with that. If you're interested, just visit our website and fill out a form or call us and we'd be glad to help you with a no cost consultation. We do all of the rebates work for you. We get the installers as well. We get the highest quality installers in the industry that have been pre-vetted and their quality checked by us. And we do it with a smile. <laughs> so that's what we do at Gridless. Now in terms of the reviews, Mitsubishi Heavy Industries has one of the best reputations in the industry for getting heating and cooling. And it's no surprise, it's a Japanese brand and Jap Japan is known for very high quality systems. They are significantly more expensive though. So if you're looking for an option that is gonna be more budget and a little bit cheaper, I wouldn't actually recommend the Mitsubishi Heavy Industries option. If you're looking for something which is super high quality and is going to last you a long time, something that you can have a lot of confidence and faith in, then that's where I would recommend the Mitsubishi system to you. There you have the video guys. Mitsubishi is a really high quality unit. We're gonna be covering the Mitsubishi electric multi-split and the Panasonic multi-splits systems next. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions whatsoever, please leave a message or comment down below and I'll be happy to help you out with that.